Hello, and um, I'm the new member of Unchained Shadows, and I run a Digit Zero deck. But this is going to be like a quick profile. So, yep. So, okay, let's talk with the deck. And the first monster is... Gauze. Gauze is just here to stop the OTK. He does his job pretty well. So, uh, then I run Double Mobius. I think Mobius is really good. People run Caius, and Caius is alright, but I'd, I prefer the back row. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Uh, we're going to Tuners, and a Gale. Gale's great. Gale status. Status is very nice, especially with Doddy. Doddy summons status too much. But, uh, yeah, I sometimes use him as a tuner, not very often. So, I, I try to protect him a lot with traps. Mm. But yeah, having him kind of a must. Uh, if you're not interested in his tuner, then that's alright. So. Uh, we have two deep sea divas. Uh, it's gonna my actual layout for this is weird, but yeah, I have two deep sea divas. I just love summoning one and getting the other one out because I love getting Goyo. Goyo's the best, no questions asked. So plus I need a lot of material, absolute zero. Then I run one Spang Gilman, which is kind of weird considering I don't run to a diva, but I need a third diva. It's annoying. So yep, he's okay. I know sometimes I draw him and he's a little bit annoying. He's still 1700, which kills a bit, but not not everything. So but yeah, he's okay. He's what off. So, then I run a Penguin Soldier. Uh, I think he's really good. Again, he kills Stardust. Well. He can kill two, two Stardust, so I quite enjoy him. He does helpful how I'll probably take him out. I might replace him with a two bomb frog if I can get one. But I'm looking for someone looking for two bomb frog. Trade. Uh, we're gonna go into searches, and I run two tomatoes. To be honest, they're good, but they're not that great. There's not too many darks in this deck. I mean, I can get out Gale, and I can get out. Uh, Diamond Dude, but that's about it really. But, uh, hmm. uh, I also got Sangan. Sangan's really good in this deck. He searches so much. So, he, him in combination with well, Dasher and his effect, so helpful. Instead of all your combo plays. So. Uh, now we're going to go into E Heroes and D Heroes. So. Start off with the beat sticks. And I just got three Neo Sailors. No, almost nobody runs these guys. Uh, yeah. So these guys basically just the beat sticks. 1900 attack, E heroes. You don't do very much besides that. Probably take them out. But still. Yep. I just got three of them. Okay. The Destiny Hero engine in this deck, and we got two Diamond Dudes. We run quite a few spells, so I think these guys are really helpful. I particularly like, you don't have to pay costs, so using Lightning Vortex, just great. I use these guys with tomatoes, and it's so fun. Let's go. We got Stratos. He is a god. This guy is so good. I mean, I kill back row, or I can search out. He really is, he does everything. I mean, mm, too bad he's limited. But still, yeah, he's good. It's only a shame he's not water. Oh well. Okay, now I got something weird. I have a dasher in the deck. I think dasher's really good, because you can use his effect and get out your Mobius or something. No. Not many people run him. But I do. I think he's good. He's not got very good, much attack mind. So, try using for like Destiny Draw or something. Just to get him in a grave or Phoenix Wing. That probably do it. So, two oceans. Now, I run ocean just because I can get him out with. Oh, I can get him with Sangam. And it's water. I don't really use his effect too much though. It's not used that often. 
because I mostly want things in the grave. But still, yeah. There we go. Uh, now we're going to go on the spells. And we have one reinforcement of the army. Just search the thing that is there. Most things are, I, I normally go for Stratos. Although sometimes I can go for Ocean if I need a water. I've got that Miracle Fusion in the hand. Uh, I play Swords, which is just good. Saves your life sometimes. But, yep, so so it goes. This is supposed to be a lot, but I'm trading Genty for it. So, yeah, the lot is nice. Uh, get rid of the uh, annoying traps and spells. We got MST and Heavy Storm. No real explanation here. Just staples here. Uh, smashing Ground. Almost certainly gonna take this out. Uh, when it, I'm gonna get, get the new gold series, and then I can finally get rid of this and get uh, Destiny Draw. Still, it's okay for time being. Lightning Vortex, just great. I mean, I mean it. A lot of people side, but yeah, I like to mean. Uh, Rain Control, take control of the monster. I mean, it's great. Probably get banned. Uh, hasn't got banned yet, so why not use it? Two Miracle Fusions and a Future Fusion. Ideally, I'd run three Miracle Fusions, but I only have two. So, Ultimate Row, Ultimate Row. But still, yeah. If you have preferred, I'd love to have it. In this deck, it works well because I only have two Deep Sea Divas, but I do have so many water targets. I mean, literally like eight water targets. That's, that's like insane, pretty much. That's the most you're going to get in the Absolute Zero deck, really. And that's not including Absolute Zero. So, yeah, Future Reason is great. Opening turn. Just awesome. As you've probably noticed, I don't have Dark Hound. And I don't have Malici uh, Malicious. I'd love to have them. But, don't have them. Still. Traps. Torrential. Just, yeah. Staple, really. Two Bottomless. Bottomless is great. Awesome. The only annoying thing is, uh, well, Salus Dragon Assault Mode, but you can kind of get around that, still. So. I don't have Mirror Force, so I have to use Sakuretsu armor. It's the next best thing, really, but it's not that good. Magic Cylinder, always nice. I've won games because of this card, it's so hilarious, but yeah, I'd run it. Draining Shield. I prefer, I'd rather run Solemn, but I don't have Solemn, so, yeah, need to get Solemn. I have one Phoenix Wing Wing Blast, I side a second, and I replace Draining Shield, but, yeah, this is always nice, get you those Stardust, and get you those Dead Draws, because you do get quite a few in this deck. Now, this is my little thing, I put Interdimensional Matter Transporter in here, just because Absolute Zero out. Get him away to the end phase, clear their field, and get him back. It's not perfect, but yeah. I'll probably take this out if it's not that reliable. But uh, see how it goes. And call the hunted. This doesn't work too well in this deck, so it may go out if something else properly comes in. So I may replace it with the other Phoenix Wing. I may put trap the shoot back in, I'm not sure. Uh, yep, now on to the side deck. 